You're very welcome back. Now, Wimbledon 2017 is starting in July. So in preparation for that, we're showing you how you can get a sophisticated yet preppy courtside chic look. For all the tennis matches we'll be attending during the mm. summer. Stylist Judy Gilroy has joined us with her favourite looks. Good morning, Judy. Good morning, Hi, Judy. ladies. And now, there is a certain etiquette when it comes to mm. attending Wimbledon, isn't it? It's, it's much about the fashion, really, as opposed to the court. Yeah, I think when it comes to Wimbledon, all eyes are on the A-listers courtside rather than on centre court. But the thing I like about Wimbledon style is it's quite preppy, it's quite chic, but it's still casual, sophisticated. Um, and there's so many occasions that we have here in Ireland, and I'm sure everybody can relate to this, where you want something nice to wear, but you don't want to be too casual. Not, and so not too dressy either. Yes, yeah. exactly. Plus it's an all-day event and you're sitting there for hours and there's long delays sometimes because of weather, isn't there? Exactly. So you so, need to be semi-practical. So comfort is key. Um, and that's what's great about this look from ontrend.eu. So this is a very simple one to put together. Uh, first up, the nice earrings. Earrings always jazz up an outfit. And these are from Costello and Costello. And they're just twelve fifty. so great price point there. Uh, and really a good one for lifting any look. The jewellery is great, all right, and I think as well, if you're going to change around an outfit, mm -hmm. throwing on a statement necklace versus some nice long chains does make a difference. Definitely, absolutely. Uh, so we've gone for a very classic look here with the lovely blazer that's in around 39 euro. Uh, and this one does come in a couple of different colors because with a color like this, you need to be careful with your skin tone that it's not gonna wash you out. But I love it, just really simple blazer over t-shirt. Uh, we've been doing it for years and I think we'll be doing it for years to come as well. Uh, so the blazer is 39 uh, and the top is just 38 as well. So really pretty one. And that one does actually have a lovely back detail to it as well so that is something that you can wear uh, on its own also lovely it so is then, lovely and classic and clean isn't it so then we've got the little shorts and i love the shorts uh, the blue and white stripe is something that's really on trend this season we're seeing a lot of it and this is a kind of a more casual but preppy chic way of wearing them um, so you can still wear these in a really more casual way going into summer and maybe on your summer holidays uh, but these are the kind of thing that during the summer when we get nice weather like we've been having lately uh, you can whip these out of the closet so with the accessories I've kept it really simple picking up on all the whites from the top we've got the beautiful bag that's under 50 euro again and this is a great day bag it's a really good day bag and that's from Costello and Costello.com Great size and a lovely big chunky bracelet as well. Yes, yeah, love a big chunky bracelet. As Laura was saying, uh, the, the statement accessories really lift an outfit. Mm -hmm. So lovely. that bag, you can fit everything, including the kitchen sink in that one. Yeah. <laughs> so if you're out for a day, it's, it's good. <laughs> idea to get something that's not a clutch because you're going to look overdressed and you won't fit anything in. Exactly and what can you fit in the clutch anyway? Yeah, yeah. Uh, so it's always nice to have a good day bag and then we've kept it really comfortable with the espadrilles as well. Lovely, very nice. Really fresh isn't it? Yeah it is fresh. Yeah and it's nice and preppy as well. Fresh preppy summer look uh, mm -hmm. and this one's from OnTrend.eu. Lovely. Okay. Thanks very much. Great. What about um, our you second now? look. So our second look, uh, we haven't forgotten about the guys today. Um, and this look comes from an Irish brand called Vidanair, uh, which I really like. Now, the polo shirt. Now, I had to have a polo shirt mm, in this segment course. when we're talking about Wimbledon uh, because it's just quintessential uh, tennis. So love this polo shirt. Only 25 euros, a great price point. Um, and this comes in lots of different colours as well. So I love to put men in pink, but I know not all men want to be dressed in pink. So this comes in a whole range of colours. So there's something to suit everyone. Uh, so it's just really nice fabric, uh, really nice fit. I think as well on men, after you hit a certain age or kind of more grown up men, anything 20s up, uh, having a collar on a t-shirt is probably the way forward mm. rather than going for a This is an argument I have with my husband who's well past 20 all <laughs> the time. But he lives in normal t-shirts. Well, he just thinks he's going to Glastonbury. Yeah. And he's going to, you know, crash collection. Going to work. Yeah. <laughs> Bit of a difference. I think the collar on a t-shirt is very smart. I think it's important. I think it, it's, uh, and the v-neck, I think it's nice mm -hmm. on men of a certain age. Mm -hmm. um, and then the chinos, you can, really can't go wrong with a nice pair of chinos. These ones are 60 quid, uh, so they're really not going to break the bank. And as you can see, we rolled them up uh, so that they're a little bit more fashion forward. It's a nice bit of detail underneath.
underneath as they're rolled up, the, 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 the different colour underneath, that makes a difference. It Just those does. extra details. And I have to say that is something about Wiedenair that I really like. It's all in the detail in the lining, even on, on their shirts. Everything has detail to it. And with men, I think it's important with men's fashion to find those pieces that have those details mm. to it because they're not as uh, out there as women. Mm -hmm. Now here's a beautiful dress. Is it a wrap dress or is it just ruched on the side? So this is kind of like a fake wrap dress. Uh, so this is actually by DVF, Diane von Furstenberg. So I sourced this look from Cobbler's Wardrobe in Sandy Mount, uh, which sells pre-loved designer clothes. Mm. Um, and this is only 145 euro, which as I'm sure you're aware yourself, you're not going to get a Diane von Furstenberg dress for. Um, so I love this and I felt like this was really Wimbledon because you always see the Middleton sisters and they're in bright colours and pretty. Uh, so I wanted to go for something nice and summery with a little bit of print. Um, so we have paired that with the cute little sandals and they're marked by Marc Jacobs as well. So cobbler's wardrobe stocks, everything from um, kind of designers like Maj, which would be in the lower price range, mm -hmm. right up to Temperley. Uh, so there's loads of hidden gems. I love there. that you've put that with flat shoes because to me that's a dressy dress with a pair of, you know, killer heels. But dressing it down like that. You've made it really daytime. Yeah, exactly. And that's one thing to bear in mind with your summer wardrobe, um, how to dress things up and dress them down. So say, for example, with these earrings, which I got from Costello and Costello, uh, they're only 25 quid. They add a little bit of sparkle. Um, Gail could pop on a heel and she's ready to go on a night on the town, but equally, she's dressed very appropriately for if she was going to a summer party or barbecue. And the jersey material dresses are so comfy. And very don't crease. flattering. Very and flattering. Don't crease. And you can travel with it as well, which is a... Exactly. An important thing for so many um, people. Such a key thing at this time of year. Who wants to go on their holidays to find out that they take out all their clothes and yeah. they need to, to iron them. everything? Yeah. 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 <laughs> it really takes the fun out of it. Doesn't no, it's ironing. <laughs>